Remember to click subscribe and notification button for more Appa's video. Hi, this is Cooking Appa. Today I'm just going to cook a simple fish. Just fried, pan fried, very simple. If you manage to find a very fresh fish, just pan fried. Now this is soul fish or usually I call it Leng Ji. Leng Ji meaning dragon tongue. Um, it has many names. Basically, it's what kind of one kind of uh, flat fish, and one side is grey color like this. The other side is actually whitish color. You notice I actually cut it into half. It's because this fish is too long, uh, very difficult for me to fry. So I actually cut it into half. And um, this fish is considered white meat fish, as you all probably know. White meat fish usually is more uh, tender and also sweeter and this fish go and pan fry until it is garing garing crispy outside tastes really really good and the only thing you need to do is after washing uh, you can actually put some salt on top of it to marinate then we can prepare the wok make sure your fish surface is very dry yeah so dry dry out with some kitchen towel then only you put in put the fish into the uh, pan or walk. Then if you are scared, use a spatula to help you. Okay. Bad example. <laughs> There's still a little bit of water just now. Put, put in the fish when uh, the oil started to smoke. Yeah? That is a good timing. Then after you put in the fish, try not to uh, touch it. You can actually see some oil spattering right now because my fish is not dry enough. Yeah, there are some water on the surface. Bad example today. Right? So anyhow, um, let it stay for about a minute or two before we flip it over. Another trick Appa is using today is I'm using a non-stick wok. So seriously, just use a non-stick wok if you are very scared of the fish sticking onto the bottom of your uh, wok. Yeah? This is after about 2 minutes. Pan frying under medium high heat on one side. Push the fish to the side. Flip it over. Look at how beautiful it is. You're going to do the same with this side. You can imagine how good this fish is going to taste. Look at this. Look at the beautiful golden brown. We will give this side another about one to two minutes. Then it is almost done. This fish, once it is ready, all the fins, the bones at the side, all can be eaten. They are all super, super crispy. Especially this tail. Ooh, can't wait. It will taste a little bit like the Sai Tao fish, but uh, the one that used to make fish ball, very very sweet, but without so much bone. Yeah? The one is very very bony. This one, no much bone. As a matter of fact, you can eat all the bones inside. This is after another about close to two minutes. Flip it over. Ah. This one, flip it over as well. It's basically done. Okay, approx somewhere around 4 to 5 minutes. Get ready your oil absorbing paper at the side. And I will push it to the side to allow the oil to render out. And then I'll take it out. Somehow today I buy a bit clumsy, but it doesn't matter, the fish will taste, still taste really good. And I'm going to cut some chili padi and light soya sauce, put in some light soya sauce and eat with, with this fish together. I hope you like my uh, simple dinner today. If you like my vid uh, video, do share my video on your Facebook to your friends. Come to Cooking Appa Facebook fan page to click like and follow button. Follow up on Instagram and subscribe to Cooking Appa YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.